Hey guys, so I'm about to start some weight training exercise. I'm going to have somebody help me film that in a little bit. I'm going to get started and let them come in whenever they're available to, available to, to grab the camera and get some shots in. And then I'm going to, I think I might go on a walk, I'm not sure. It depends on how tired I am after all the exercise I'm about to get. <laughs> Because I'm not just doing weight training, I'm also going to be doing some crunches. And, uh, the only kind of push-ups I can do, <laughs> which, uh, some people call lazy or sissy push-ups, but I can't physically push myself up. I don't have enough upper body strength for it at the moment. Uh, yeah, anyway, see you soon. Hey guys, so I started doing some uh, arm curls. I'm going to do a few more things. You know, some different lifts and whatnot. And then I'm going to move on to the crunches, so let's get back to work. Well, when you're doing any sort of arm exercises, one thing you got to do, or got to remember, is when you bring it up, squeeze your fist, because that will create tension in the muscle, thus creating denser muscle. That, uh, Smokey, get down. what's it called? Will be better for uh, strength and weight loss. And what's it called? Uh, what's it called? Uh, yeah, it's better for you that way. So I did 10 reps on each side, I'm going to do 10 more on this, 10 more on this, and then move on to something else and start filming after, or once I get into that. Now, another thing before I continue with this arm is if you want to do, uh, if you're trying to go for bulkier muscle, one thing I've learned is you do more reps with less weight. That way, if you're going for mass, you can get bigger arms or what have you. Sorry, I haven't done this in a while. As you could probably tell. Anyway, last set for these. my elbow on that of a ninth rep something you gotta try not to do it's not good uh, 
good for your arm. You can actually hurt your elbow doing that one, so I try not to make that mistake too often. Anyway, I'm going to get on to the next thing and start filming when I can. Alright. See you soon. Alright guys, so I'm about to do some more exercises. I'm going to try to work out my shoulders. As, as like last time, when you go up, make a, you clench your fist a little bit. That tenses the muscles. I'm going to do uh, ten reps. Well, three. Yeah, ten reps. One set. You can hold it for a second if you want to try to tense for a little bit longer. That was 10. I'm going to move on to another one. I'll do that in a minute. Then you can hit the button again. Alright guys, so the last thing I'm doing with the weights it works out this part of your arm right here. Fairly simple. And once again, but this time I only use one weight. You hold it up like this, and you bring it back. Just bend the elbow. Don't move the arm. So, ten. We're gonna switch arms. Do ten more. Once again. Don't bend the arm, just the elbow. So that's it for the weight training. I'm going to do some crunches next and I'll get back to you when I'm about to do those. Alright guys, last part of the workout for the day. I'm going to do 30 crunches and then call it a night. Crunches. Try to switch them up like I did. It works different parts of the abs. Really? Ugh. Gets you going. It's a great way to end any uh, day of exercise. If you ask me, I always like to end uh, anything with crunches. Now that I'm really starting to get into it, uh, you know, anyway, have a good night. I'll see you guys on YouTube.